All right, people. Welcome back. More daily duel. So we have a mega chaos here. Hi. Oh my God, chaos here again. So we're gonna be talking about the list. Every single tag partner has to talk about the list. Well, I guess yep. except for Tiago because he can't talk. Oh yeah, damn! Exactly. He's, this man's you ended up. Oh, it's that uh, probably that uh, Mist Valley Ninja deck. With pendulums? If that Apex Avion. Ew. Ew, I don't like fucking Avion and shit. <laughs> Did he pendulum summon that? No, he didn't. Now he's pendulum summoning. Okay. Yeah. We are soon getting some new magicians. Holy shit. In the class of rebellions that. Now we're making some 2 rank 4s, I guess. I... You revealed everything to us, man. <laughs> Was that really worth it? Anyway. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> anyway, we're going to be talking about the ban list. We're gonna have to... A lot of cards got moved, so we have a lot yep. to talk about. So I pulled up the list on my 3DS. I did not even know I could do that. But I was like, you know what? Let's go ahead and see if I can access it. And I can. You know what that means, Omega Chaos? Yeah. I can look at porn on my DS. No. Well, <laughs> I could do that. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> anyway, all right. Let's begin. So, starting off, the Dragon Rulers are banned. Yeah, I am very happy about that. I was advocating that change for a while, and I'm yeah. Finally, they did it. Yeah. Do you get? They were just more... yeah, way too insanely broken, and uh, uh, so many cards were hit because of them. And they were restricting, restricting future card design. So they had to cope with it much because any generic dragon support uh, could have uh, made them broken again. Yep. So, what they, they lost connection. I didn't even do anything. I think they quit because his play was so fucking stupid that there's really no point in staying tagged with him. <laughs> like, literally, he burned up resources just to summon a monster that can get 101. <laughs> like, really? Yeah. All right, let's get another duel in. Be right back. All right, so hopefully our opponent did much wiser plays than that last opponent. Cause that was just mm. yep. Anyway, uh, so yeah, I mean it's a copy and paste from uh, from most of you, but still, uh, it's such a fine fine choice to do. So thank yeah, you. Very good. As soon as you loaded up the list and you saw that blaster, <laughs> just a smile just grew in your face. We're finally free. <laughs> uh, all right. Yeah. Next card that was banned. Snatch Steel? Yeah. Yeah, they made a mistake in the last ban list and they fixed it pretty much. No, yep. there was an experiment gone wrong. Oh, anyway. fuck. <laughs> of course. Oh, my God. But it doesn't really even too much, I think. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> I don't have a stronger monster than that. Wow. I do have Royal Decree for, but I can't really do a play this turn then. That's what I've been saying to everybody all day whenever they do something. They like, to the list, I'm like, nope, enjoy it. Just enjoy that. <laughs> uh, should I set the uh, chat to, or should I keep it in my hand? What? Oh my god, people have been quitting like crazy. Yep, alright. <laughs> We're back again, again. All right. So, yeah, snap still, bam. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna give my opinion because I just thought about it and I said, I was like, if I literally talk about the same things repetitively <laughs> over and over for these videos and give my same opinions, like if you guys want to know my opinion, just watch one video. <laughs> anyway, yep. moving on to the next card. Uh, Sinister Serpent coming back with the Arata. Yeah, with the Arata, it's not even very good anymore. It's yeah, pretty useless now. Like. I don't think uh, the Rata was even needed. It could have come back even without it. Like, uh, it would make those powerful ass cards that, uh, like, you know, like Phoenix Woman Blast and fucking Divine Wrath, co pretty much costless. Yeah, that's so true. I, 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 I can see the point of view, especially since those cards have been going up in popularity uh, as of late. But uh, I'm just hoping that next list they go ahead and put it up to three, just so it could get just be a little bit more playable. Because that, yeah. cause that oh. one, you you can't use it. It's absolutely fucking trash. So. Hopefully, at, uh, at multiples, you can at least do something, because it just says banish uh, Sinister Serpent during the end of phase, so if yep. you have multiple Sinister Serpents, you can at least get one back. Alright, uh, next card, Tour Guide. 
Mm, that was another thing I, I kind of wanted, so yeah, kind of glad they, they did it. I actually predicted it in my uh, previous panelist prediction, uh, not of course this panelist, but yeah. Yeah, you know, uh, you know it's, like, it's like you predict it and they don't do it, late. and then next time you just give up. Yes, I can, you know, yeah. fuck it. And then they do it, it's just like, now you're making me look like a douchebag. <laughs> you know, everybody was all hating on you and your video when you said Tear God the One. Like, oh, no, no, not Tear God, not Tear God the One. <laughs> and now, now you're laughing in everybody's face. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, uh, I think it was totally just a final hit. I, like I said, the Konami went a little bit more conservative than even me, and I'm like one of the most conservative duelists. I, I thought, I was trying to think of their profit margin. I was like, well, maybe they'll put it at two uh, to start off with, just for burning this. They're like, nope, one. Like, oh, okay, 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 Konami. I, well, I uh, knew pretty much that they were not going to hit any of the Burning Abyss monsters themselves, so a tour guide was pretty much the only option. So, yeah, tour guide. All right. Next, we have uh, Dragon Ravine returning. Mm, I am very glad about this, but at the same time, only at one. Like, uh, uh, it, it they were copying it that much, uh, unfortunately. But it, it's something at least. Could it, could the card go to multiples? Sure. Uh, w the reason why it didn't go to multiples is because we copied the uh, OCG, and despite OCG banning Dragon Rose, they still have Dragon Ravine at one. So we're just like, okay, we'll copy that. And because Konami doesn't want to move uh, uh, cards immediately from uh, banned to free or to... Uh... Yeah, it really seems like they don't like to do that either. I don't know what I want to go into. So I'll just go into plain code. It really doesn't matter. Nurse? Who's playing Nurse? A third <laughs> truck in Goblinburg. <laughs> what the fuck? Goblinburg, like, is, is Goblin? Am I missing something? Is Goblinburg playing nurse? Am I missing something? No, of course not. Ah, <laughs> uh. how's your hand? Mm, not that great. It's not terrible, but because uh, the problem is sense. I can kill one of them, but then he could just summon another level four and XC and get rid of me, right? I have Regeki, I'm thinking about just regeki him, just so I have to make him force that out. Well, but I want to use my Shadol Fusion, so let them make an Ixis. Oh monster. yeah, right, I forgot, yeah, Shadol Fusion. Good thing you're not OCG and you can go into Construct, <laughs> huh? <laughs> yep. Damn. Yeah, it's fucking... quite unusual that they uh, didn't hit Shadols at all in this panel list. Yeah, at all. I was just short my balance was something target. I'll probably, well, I probably. Like, Stores yeah. have now survived three panelists. Yeah. Like that's insane. Should I just MST that? Uh, you mean the skyscraper? Yeah. Mm. If you want, to, I guess it's not really I that. Want, I just don't want to get shit back, and we already okay. got Royal Decree. Yeah, fuck it. I don't like, how about you just don't fucking get that? <laughs> All right, so what were we on? What were we on? Oh, yeah, Dragon Ravine. Uh, preparation of rights. Uh, of course, uh, indirect hit to Necros. Uh, it's a generic ritual support. I don't uh, like uh, uh, when they hit uh, something like that. But uh, oh well, what can you do? I guess they had to hit something. Yeah. And uh, that was like the most busted card. Yeah, that's too big. It's basically like a plus one mm -hmm. in one card, and yeah, but no searcher. So. And this was supposed basically you can could search out any Rutla moss in the Necros deck because of Brianak, of course. It uh, works uh, way too well with that card. But kind of sad that now Heart of Perfection deck is now dead completely. <laughs> it can't really function without that card very well. Yep. So that's done. Ah, <sighs> so can you fight the Goyo, or are we gonna be taking some damage? Um, uh, I can summon a fusion next turn. So. Oh, okay. Well, don't kill my plane coat then. I'll kill my plane coat so I can get the search when it hits my graveyard again. Ah, <sighs> uh, okay. So what was next? Sacrifice. Mm, of course, hit to Clifford's uh, pretty decent hit, I guess. It's of course it was very good searcher card and uh, had very useful effects. 
I don't even think they're tier one anymore. I personally I would have just hit uh, Clifford Scout one and that's it. Like I said, they, I think that that's was another the broken card in the deck. That was another copy of OCG, so. Yeah, pretty much. All right. Uh, symbol of heritage, and then we can go ahead and just talk about Lone Fire as well. Yep. Hmm. I think it's um, good, I guess. That yeah, no plants can be more even more consistent. Yeah, uh, I really don't care one way or another. I just I just don't think it's really necessary to put symbol heritage just for lone fire. Like you already have two lone fire, triple oasis, triple call the haunted and all that good shit, so you're fine, but alright, that's fine. Uh Temple of Kings with the Errata. Mm. Yeah, it's uh you can't really have the cave with that card anymore, so why not? I mean you uh, that card is just <laughs> not good. Yeah. Like I said, that card will probably just go up to three. Next list, anyway. Yeah, more than likely. Oh, that's nice So you sent us Shadal Fusion. Why'd you send us Shadal Fusion? I didn't have any other Shadals to send because I threw them all. Oh. Only run two other Shadals, like Shadal Dragon and uh, Hedgehog. And you drew them both? Yep, exactly, of course. You know when you <laughs> 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 Alright, so, yeah. Uh, crush card. Um, even with the Rata, it's still a very powerful card. Yes, I do agree. I know it's like, it's like you can go up to multiple and like, no, 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 it's still a powerful card. Yeah, it can't go to multiples for sure. So, uh, yeah, very powerful card. Let's see what uh, Burning of Death do. So, you can uh, go ahead and uh, put Crush Card in for one of, you, one of the two missing Vanity's Emptiness that you have. <laughs> yep. Alright, uh, next card, uh, Extend the Spirit. Mm, same thing as with uh, Temple of the Kings, you can't uh, FTK with that card anymore. Like, take out your opponent in one turn. Or... <laughs> because, of course, both players have to now have 15 cards in the graveyard. So I guess you've got a Kamikaze with your Construct, huh? Okay. I get Shadal Fusion back for. Mm -hmm. And that's why Shadals are still very broken. I still hate them, so I don't even care. I, you know, they could they could die in a fire for all I care. Why do you have to have twenty two attack and twenty two D? I hate that. Lost. <laughs> like, like really? Why? Now I gotta go into something else to kill you. Okay. Yep, uh, I guess I'll just go into him. Okay. Alright, where are we on? Next card. Sorry, I got so quiet I was thinking. Uh, some of the best parts of the list. Uh, skill drain to one. Yep, that was definitely a very good hit. Even OCG didn't do it. Yeah, even OCG didn't do it. I was just like, wow, finally. How long have I been asking for that card? For like three years? <laughs> Ever since I made my YouTube channel? <laughs> Every single time I do a ban list prediction? Lost. I'm like, please, can you hit this card down to fucking one, please? I know it's not relevant, but still, I'm tired of this shit. <laughs> so, yes. Yeah, finally. it was definitely very abused in Clifford's. Mm -hmm. But now other skill drain reliant decks are, no, are now also dead, so yeah. All right. Next, we have uh, vanities. Mm, very glad about this as well. It was just we very degenerate uh, spells and lockdown card like royal oppression. Yep. Yep. I guess that it probably should uh, be banned. Actually, <laughs> I want to see what it does at one. Cause I, I I used to think that you know soul charge that should be banned, but you know nothing says that one, and you'll see as much. It's a it's a sacky degenerate card, but at least you don't have also to deal with you it. missed one card, a limited section, ring of destruction. Oh, oops, <laughs> my bad. All right, ring of destruction. <laughs> yeah, even in with its Serata, it's still a very powerful card. Just uh, 
destroy any monster and inflict damage. Yep. Oh, it can it could probably wrap up a duel, so I probably think that card should stay at one. And OCD agrees because the yeah, card's still at one. Same here. Alright, so that's the limited. Alright. On to uh the semi limited. We have Scout. Well the most broken part of the Cliff Vortex, so basically gives you a free card every turn, so it had to be hit somehow. Yeah, like I said, I don't even think Cleaves are even uh are even tier. I don't even think they're tier one anymore. Yeah. They're 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 so obvious to stop. Like you literally have one sk one skill drain, one vanities, and two scout and two scouts. Well, I still got my triple MSTs. Like you're probably gonna get it. So <laughs> well, they're basically now like normal pendulums, basically. Yep. Yeah. yeah. But they are still better than normal pendulums, probably. <laughs> Hmm. It might be debatable. I, it, 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 if it is, it's just because of scout. Yep. You know, if normal pendulums had a monster in the pendulum scale, I could search for another pendulum monster, then maybe we could talk. And normal pendulums can go to the extra deck at least. So do Cleaves. Only if they use uh, the cut, the small pile. What are you talking uh, about? They, they all go back to the extra deck. Oh, they can, oh, you're saying they can access the extra deck. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah. I mean, yeah. So it's debatable. Mm -hmm. it's, cl it's close. You know, they're definitely not the the, you know, the pendulum all star deck that they used to be. Definitely not. All right, next, uh, Necros of Baronic. Mm. Definitely a hit uh, to Necros. It's a pretty good hit, but it doesn't really affect the Necros deck too much, and they will still be the best deck for sure. Yep, definitely. Probably at least near tier zero. It it, it all comes down to how strong Burning Abyss are. It really does. Uh, if Burning Abyss can't keep up with them and they get left behind, then they'll they'll push to tier zero. Yep. Do you think any deck has stepped up to tier one, or do you still no. think? Uh, so tier one is still, for all we know, is still just burning abyss and necros. Yep, exactly. All right. Uh, uh, Xi'an, to two. Mm, that's very good. Uh, Xi'an is not uh, as hard to deal with as it was back then. We have like a costal one on one and dark everyone exists like and all that. And so as long as gateway is banned, I don't give a shit. <laughs> As long yep. as Gateway's banned, but Gateway's not even banned in OCG, and they have three Shannon. I'm like, okay, <laughs> that's a little bit crazy, but sure. Like Triple Shen, first turn Triple Shen can hurt anybody. So, <laughs> you know, you only have so much you can one on one and cast out before you just get jumped by all the Shens. So, yeah. Uh, and you can just use Exit on them if they summon three Shen. <laughs> yeah, as long as they're up on resources. As long as they didn't burn too many resources. You know. Oh, right. Bites paper. I'm like, what are, what, are you, what are you doing here? What are you doing? You got on us? Uh, Charger Light Brigade. Hmm. That was very surprising for me. Uh, but since uh, the Light Swan Trigger Roller variant is now dead, I don't see Light Swans uh, doing much damage. And uh, it will just help the decks that use the Light Swan engine, like. Uh, Infernoids, Chaos Dragons, and uh, uh, some variants of Synchrons. Yep, I guess they're kind of trying to mend the wounds that are left f from the their Dragon Rose getting banned. <laughs> yep. Alright, uh, what is next? Sacred Sword. Yeah, with Dragon Rose banned, it's uh, pretty much a useless card now. Yep. Maybe do would Red Eyes use it? Red Eyes uh, have their own uh, draw card, um, card of Red Jewel, and it's better than yeah, Sacred a lot Sword. better. You discard level seven Red Eyes, and then you can send uh, Red Eyes from your deck to the graveyard. And then draw two. Yep, that's good. That's good. It's better than banishing your level sevens. So yeah, that card will probably go up to three next list. Yeah, more than likely. All right, now for the big old long list of unlimited bits. All right, let's start off with just the baby rowers. Well, I don't think uh, there's anything to say about that. It's a nice little troll. 
In fact, you know what's funny? A ton of people were saying they're like, Band of Dragon was bring, bringing back the baby to three. And people were like, no, nah, that's stupid. That's too trolly. Konami won't do that. <laughs> they did it. <laughs> it was a dick move. Just like, enjoy your uh, your normal monsters, your level three little dragons that don't fucking do anything. <laughs> All right. Brother of the Five Shows Spirit. Mm, yeah, Free Axis Far Fist are now uh, pretty good. You think they're gonna do anything? What mm, tier do you think? Not they are? sure. Because we didn't really see them at all in TG. Yeah, at they, full yeah. power. Yeah, it got hit like as soon as it came out here in TCG. Yeah, exactly. So let's see what they can do. You know. We hit Spirit and they hit uh, Rooster. I, I, you know what? I think they hitting Spirit was the correct choice, but hey, that we went our separate ways on that one. All right, next, uh, fuck Gladiator Beast. <laughs> yeah, bestiare. Fuck that! I hate Glads. <laughs> yeah, true, but they haven't done anything. I don't for care. So long time. They can go fuck themselves for all I care. <laughs> I hate Glads. And I don't think that a free pieces bestiare even matter as much to that deck. It's just a little bit more consistent that they don't just lose their, their one bestiary to bottom and stuff or anything like that. Fuck lads. <laughs> Eat that deck. Alright. Next, we have Gorus. Yeah, it didn't really do anything at two, so why not? Yeah. No one said, uses, it, uses it anymore. I said Gorus are two last list. And they I once so thought that Gorus should be banned, but how times have changed, like, so suddenly. Yeah. Yeah. Because <laughs> now we can actually summon monsters and do plays to combat it. And you gotta have, like, no cards on your field. Like, that, that, that's just... That's risky or a dead draw, so that's fine. You know, Trag can stay at you. Trag is much stronger than Gorus, so... Alright, X, we already talked about Lone Fire, so, uh, Goyo Guardian. Well, no one really even used uh, two of that card, so yeah, at three it's not do anything anyway. And Heraldic Cell Communication. Yeah, it gives back uh, more consistency to Heraldic. And because they banned Dragon Aura, so the Heraldic Dragon Aura with Dark Matter are not going to be a threat anymore. Yeah. It will just help my Ultima Heraldic deck. God, this duel is going so fucking slow. I'm just gonna wrap this up. This should be it. Yep. God, I'm tired. I wanna go take a nap. And I gotta quickly render and edit and get this video up. <laughs> yep. I'm so late. I gotta get this video up in 20 minutes. I, I you know what? I don't think that's possible. <laughs> this video yeah, it's will probably really be late. <laughs> Now with how fast it take, how long it takes to render and upload and all that shit. Oh, oh the mirror force, but the other crew is up. Maybe they chain MST or something. Wow, lol. Uh huh. Keep on going. You got another one? <laughs> Woo! Awesome. <laughs> that soccer song are too good. <laughs> oh yeah, alright. Yeah, all traps. You know what? Fuck you. <laughs> <Lost. laughs> Damn. They were seriously wanting to one up us with all that background. No, thank you. I don't like magical cylinder. I just wanted to state that. I don't like that card. Yeah, like, unless, unless you're unless uh, you're gonna hit your uh, opponent yeah. for game, I don't like it because it's literally a neg. Like you don't you it don't take care of for sure. Yeah, you don't take care of the monster. The monster is still there. So like, what did you do? Like, shit. I'd rather play Sakuretsu armor over fucking <laughs> magical <laughs> cylinder. At least the monster is gone. But no, Mirror Force, of course, first. Mirror Force, deep prison, then Sakuretsu, then fucking magical cylinder. <laughs> But okay. power traps are not really that good in general. Yeah, like if I'm gonna play a fucking battle trap, I need I need, I need to at least get the monster off the field. Like, come on. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna I'm gonna go ahead and call it episode. So I apologize for this video being much shorter than slates, but it wasn't our fault. We went against fucking. It was more of a panelist discussion than dwelling for sure. Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> but uh, literally in slates video, our last duel was a uh, a synchro deck and necros. So. Wow. <laughs> like, will you two please hurry up? <laughs>
Anyway, uh, thank you, Omega Cast, for joining me. No problem. Glad to join as always. So, in the link in the description will be the upcoming Choice Awards. You guys, go ahead, click that link, and vote for us. Vote for. Yeah, please us. vote for me, Lalo. Yeah. <laughs> For best deck profiles, I want you to win that because you, you know, okay. you you definitely That's, deserve best. That deck will profile. be very nice set, <laughs> for sure. Is it? Every time I turn around, you're always doing some unique deck profile. So yeah, but anyway. that's my speciality, speciality, speciality pretty much. Yeah. So our number one goal is to make sure that Yugi no no wins nothing. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm just like, who is this guy, and why is everybody voting for him? <laughs> All right, so if we can get you guys' help, that would be awesome. So, you know, whatever category you want to put me in, sure. Uh, I really would like uh, Omega Chaos to win for Best Deck Profile. And I can't be a next great Yugi tuber but I think Stanzi would be kind of interesting for next great Yugi tuber too. So I think that him being in the competition next year, or this year, would be interesting. So I'm going to vote Well, I too. might be in it as well. I'm not sure yet. Really? They announced it. Okay. You can go for it. Like I said, I don't like that damn competition anyway. <laughs> yeah, we'll see if it I mean, popularity contest. You know what? No offense to you, but you're going to lose. Yeah, I know. You're going to lose, gonna lose so hard. They're literally going to see that you're you're androgynous, and they're going to be like, oh, no, I'm not going to vote for them, and then they're just going to fucking just shit on you. Yeah, I we'll swear get so, to God. so much hate, though. Yeah, you are. You are. You're going to get so much hate. <laughs> I wouldn't even I wouldn't even try if I were you. <laughs> I'm sorry, but they're gonna shit all over you. <laughs> I, I don't want to see that comment section. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so uh, yeah. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode, Daily Duel. Thank you, Mega Cast, for joining me. You already said that. <laughs> oh, oops. <laughs> okay. Well, well, thank you twice. You're awesome. No <laughs> and uh, <laughs> and uh, if I haven't seen you in Slate's video, I'll see you guys tomorrow with Stu and Stanzi, of course, doing what we've been doing. All five people. All five people are going to get to talk about the ban list. I do this every time there's a new ban list. Just sit there and talk. <laughs> That's the... Oh, all right. Before we go, before we go, if you can make any changes. Well, first, what what do you give the rating out of, out of 10 stars? What do you give this ban list? Mm hmm about seven stars it's pretty good very nice but not perfect those didn't get hit at all and necros are still the best deck and will be dominating a lot so yeah all right that's all can, i can say if you can make any change what will you make um i would hit shadow fusions for sure and uh, instead of semi-limiting semi-limiting pionaka i would hit it to one okay i give this list i give this list a nine out of ten I love wow. this list so much. You ban, you you ban the Dragon Rose, you ban Snatch Steel, you hit Skill Drain, and you hit Vanities. That's enough to make me a happy boy. So, well, it uh, was definitely the best uh, ban list since uh, September 2013. Yeah, and moved almost as many cards too. It moved like 30 something cards, and that list moved like 40 something. So, lots of cards moved. And if I could change yep. anything, uh, say Releaser banned, because <laughs> fuck that. Like Necros shouldn't be able to lock you down like that. And I would hit Mind Crush because that card's a little bit too powerful. <laughs> to be at multiples. All right, ending the video now. All right, people, thanks for watching.